This is the beautiful Pyrenees, not far from the Spanish border, and it is a region very rich in rustic ingredients. The amazing 13th century market square of the small town of Mirepoix is where every Monday morning hundreds of artisans and farmers display the best of the season. The climate in valleys at the foot of the Pyrenees is mild and suited for kitchen gardens and the selection of local vegetables is magnificent. It is a feast for the eyes. The artichokes are superb and popular with families and the freshly cut firm asparagus are a treat for the beginning of a special French meal. The cheeses of the Pyrenees are very delicious. They come from small villages at between 500 meters and, and a kilometer high. The pastures are very rich and they make some goat cheese, also cow's milk, but the one I am testing is a mix of cow's milk with ewe's milk. And it is really delicious. On market day, the local boulanger prepares many croustades a tasty type of pie made with battery puff pastry and a secret filling that includes apples or pears. Yum! This is the stall of the family Palma. They have been at the market for the last 100 years. And at their farm, they raise duck for the foie gras. They fatten their ducks with some white corn. At the market, they cut the ducks into pieces. They remove the foie gras from inside the duck they cut the fillets, they cut all the parts, and then back at the farm also, they transform the duck into salamis, they dry the duck fillets, they uh, confit the duck leg in, in the duck fat. The duck fat is the local fat that they use in lots of their cooking. And of course, they also uh, confit the gizzard. The gizzards are an important part that is used in salads in many restaurants and at home. This duck and prune dish is a great example of the local taste. A first brush, two duck legs with oil, then season with salt, pepper and fennel seeds, and bake in a 180 degree oven for about 30 minutes. With the fatty skin on top, the duck will be well basted during the roasting. I steam some sliced carrots in a saucepan before blending them with a knob of butter to a smooth puree. After transferring the cooked duck legs to a dish, I drain the fat and cook a chopped shallot for a few minutes. I add a little wine, four tablespoons of strong chicken stock and 10 prunes before stirring in a little butter. I reheat the duck legs in the sauce before serving on a little carrot puree and garnish with the prunes. Les cuisses de canard au pruneau, a superb treat from the French Southwest. Tomorrow we get deep into the Pyrenees and we visit a very special pig farm that makes the best ham.